Laura? I turned on the radio and what... Glory. I should have called you. I'm really sorry. No, you didn't have to call me. You have enough to handle here. He came in the house. They shot out all the windows. They blew the door off its hinges. Lucky was downstairs with Luke and Sonny at the time. It's only by the grace of God. With the baby. She was upstairs with me. I put her in the closet, left Foster standing guard. I tell you, I've been through some terrible things in my life, but the sound of those bullets ripping through my house, I'm going to hear that sound until the day I die. Uh, whose blood is this here? I killed someone. Good. Don't trust anybody. You do that hound of the Baskervilles routine, boy. Good for you. Come on. Go in the kitchen and watch the back door. Oh! Luke! I, I can't do this. Please. Sweetheart, Please, please to... listen to me. Sonny swears... Scully's boys have had ample motivation to take a shortcut out of town, but just in case one of them may have slipped through the cracks, I'm going to sleep here Luke, on the couch no, tonight. Luke. Laura, hear me out. If they come, they're looking for me, baby. They'll search the house. They'll find you and the kids. If I'm here sitting on the couch, no fuss. No fuss, they'll leave you alone. I'm going to make you understand this. I don't want guns in this house anymore. Sweetheart, I'm not armed. Hey, cowboy. Um, I, I heard you and Mom talking down here earlier, and I decided to stay in my room. Was, was that okay? Anything you do is okay by me. Dad, she seemed really upset. Well, it's only temporary. Your mom's having like an allergy flare-up. She's always been allergic to guns, you know. And I, I don't disagree with that point of view. I can't dispute it. But unfortunately, there are wise guys out there that don't share her aversion to weaponry. Dad, are they coming back? They might, but there are cops out there, son. And I've also got some other guys watching the house. And I'm here tonight to make sure that you and your mother and Lulu are safe. If you say so. I believe it. You know, this is all going to be over soon. No, it is. Your mother always comes to her senses. When the thing is over, and the guns are put away, we'll all be back together as a family again. Nothing to worry about. Hey, you can believe that, too. Okay. Good.
Don't be sad, sweetheart. I never was very good at hiding my feelings from you. There's no reason to start now. Anything left of your back sleeping like that? Is there a back under this bag of bleached bones and flabby flesh? Hey, bat breath, come on, what am I, uh, goose down? Go on, get out of here, go on, go on. Oh, brother. <laughs> oh, my foot's asleep, damn. Oh, 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 oh. Oh. Lovely Lou's going to be up soon, so I'll, uh, I'll make Lucky's lunch. Honey, I'm so sorry for all of this. Me too. Do you want to have breakfast? Breakfast? You mean before I have to go? Leslie Lou was always hungry as a horse when she wakes up, so I better get going. I'll, I'll uh, be on my way. Mom, have you seen my Spanish book? It's right there on the table next to your lunch. You guys working things out? You're allowed to miss your father, Lucky. Yeah. You do too. Very much. Hey. It's gonna be all right. I'm gonna take care of you and Leslie Lou, okay? Yeah. I will. I know. I sweetheart. I, I promise. <laughs> 